glad you're back, everybody. Well, atrial fibrillation, also known as AFib, impacts 2.7 to 6.1 million people in the U.S. at any given time. Well, AFib is when the upper chamber of the heart is out of step with the lower chamber. While it's not a fatal disease, there's still a need for good technology surrounding it. ABC 24's Sheila Whaley shows us what doctors in our area are doing to increase the awareness around the condition. March 1st, 2022, I went to St. Francis with COVID, breathing very deeply and hard and strained, unable to breathe. They told me I wasn't testing positive for COVID. I was testing, I was, I was in AFib. AFib is an irregular rhythm of the heart, mostly involving the upper chambers called atrium of the heart. It causes a lot of symptoms, like they can have shortness of breath, they can have chest pain, they can have palpitation, dizziness, fatigue. Hey, good morning, Mr. Good morning. How are you, sir? They also can lead people to have other complications as bad as congestive heart failure. They can have stroke in different severity and also they can lead to death. Deep breath, sir. Breathe. In and out. I'm going to look at your legs, make sure you have no swelling. The only thing that's different is I take more medications than I ever had before, but I feel perfect. I mean, I do. You're as good as normal, as good as new. I feel like I've been to Service Master and it never happened. <laughs>